Ready, aim, fire. My name is Peter Johnson. I'm a journalist. A few days ago, I decided to investigate an old abandoned factory. Claims of supernatural activity and ghost sightings have been very prolific on the internet. I began my investigation thinking I could easily debunk this one. But I was wrong. I've already seen things that go against all known signs and everything I, I thought I knew. I've tried to stay away since my first encounter, but I cannot. It's like something is calling me from deep down that stairwell, like a voice in the dark. As I enter the abyss, the abyss also enters me. Hey, what's up YT Gamers? Welcome to the very first episode of the terror genre on this hub channel. I uh, hope you guys enjoy your stay here on this video. I hope you enjoy the video thoroughly throughout. Uh, today we're playing Stairs, which is an indie horror game in pre-alpha. This is a demo, I believe. Just a demo. But I've heard really good reviews about it and I cannot wait to get into it. I cannot stress this enough, you guys. So I hope you stick around to enjoy this video and here we go. Um, so it looks like we're on the staircase right now, as the uh, game title would have you believe. Uh, let's go down here and see what's down here. Um, I don't know how scary this game is, actually. I know it is a scary game, I just don't know if it, how it will rack up against all the uh, bigger horror titles like Outlast and Amnesia. So we'll, I guess we'll have to find out soon enough, huh? Oh boy, so we're going down this staircase. It, uh, it's going down quite a ways, actually. Into hell. You know you're going into hell when you fucking walk down a staircase. How did I even come in here? Journalist, as always. That was the same case with Outlast. You're just a journalist and you just get yourself fucked over. Um... Sky Doze... Strum Triangle... Thing. How do we interact? Oh, ease to open doors as usual. Okay, so that's pretty standard shit. Oh, God, no. What is this? Oh, God, some stuff went down in here. Did I miss the party last night? Why the hell did you need pans in the middle of a freaking hell? What the pulver? Most brand, I don't, okay, I don't give a shit about that. Oh, God, let's go down here. I have my headphones turned up to max volume right now, so. Oh, there's a lever in here. What the hell is that ambiance noise? Holy shit. So let's, uh, let's just flip this, good chunk of roo. Um, ooh, turned on the lights, yeah. There's a missing fire extinguisher right here. That is a fire hazard. I'm afraid I'm gonna have to put y'all out of business. Ugh. All right, let's go. Let's see what the hell this game is all about. Let's see. We look. We got a locked door over here for what it looks like. I'll need the coat to open it. Okay. Hello there, sir. Me, I guess. You need the code to open it, eh? So uh, let's go ahead and see if we can find that code. Oh, everybody knows that it plays <laughs> plays horror games that bathrooms are the worst thing no matter what in horror games so let's uh yeah there's no excuse to why these would be good they're just creepy as hell okay let's let's not stick around in here too long actually can we open these no I don't think we can alright let's just move on going up here can we run oh we can run but it's really loud and I don't know if we should because there might be creatures lurking in the distance oh god what is this? Four schematics and door codes. This could be very useful. It could be very useful. Oh, actually, I like that feature a lot. How it just takes a snap picture of it. Oh, uh, so I guess that was the code. I don't know if I remember that or if I have to or not. Six one four one. It's not that complicated. I'm pretty sure I could have been way worse, like a seventeen digit number. I can't go in there. Oh, oh, what the hell? Strobe light party without me. What do you guys think you're up to in here? Taking shits with your strobe lights and whatnot. Let me see what's going on. Oh! Oh! Hello? Hello? I don't like this at all. Hello? Do you need some privacy? Do you need some privacy, sir? 
Open this fucking door right now before I come under there. Never mind. I'm gonna leave him alone. He seems like he's having a nice time. Doors do not just open and close by themselves, man. There is some poltergeist going on here. Oh, oh, oh. Um. <laughs> I'm gonna go out on a limb here and say that these people are not real and that I'm just going psycho crazy right now. So let's just put in the code. Alright, uh. Stand back, this could be intense. That's right, the door is open. What about it? What about it, you guys? I honestly have no idea what to expect from this. So I guess that we can't go this way since it's blocked off by such heavy-duty shelves. These shelves are just impairing me from going into the depths of the unknown. Which can be a good thing, I guess. It's really a hassle, actually. Why can't I just push those to the... Oh! Oh! Oh shit! It's oh shit! Ages. No one's come down here yet. What the hell? What are we going to do, guys? You just need to sit tight and wait. They'll come get us when they realize we're gone. They could even be outside the door right now, just minutes from getting it open. We just have to wait. I don't know how much more of this I can take. I say, don't we have anything left to eat? No, nothing. Except each other. You gonna Except eat each other? Nothing. Cannibalism. Oh, oh, nothing. Nothing. Jacob, go check the kitchen again. Samuel and me will check the other door. Hmm. I don't know why y'all are complaining. Y'all like y'all had a good Last Supper right here, you know? Got some comfortable tempur mattresses and stuff that you didn't even put on the beds like you usually would. Alright, so, um... I don't think there's anything in here. Did I miss something back here? I don't think there's anything in here that I actually needed. I think this is just kind of a, uh... Just a... I heard clicking noises. What the fuck was that? I don't know. Anyways, let's just keep on going, moving up, and see what we see farther down in the depths of hell. I actually, I don't actually know if this game does jump scares or not, so I'm kind of hesitant right now on, as to what to do. Is that a something? Oh boy, is that a something or is that a nothing? I don't like that noise. Oh my god. No, no, no. No, 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 fuck the you. I swore I saw... Okay, you guys had to have seen something. Or I'm just going completely crazy right now. Because I swear to God, I saw something down there. And last time I checked, I am perfectly sane. But then again, I have never checked. So, I mean, it could be wrong. Yeah, I'm saying. Oh, God, what is this? All right, so Looks like, like the exit door needs a fuse of its own to work. Or you could just answer for me, Mr. All-Knowing all Being, that is supposedly me. Uh, oh! Holy shit! We need to do something, Samuel! What are you suggesting, no. Isaac? There's nothing for us to do other than wait for help. And eat each and other. what if it doesn't come? What then, Samuel? What if help comes, but it's too late, and we've already started? That's not gonna happen! Oh god, they're, they're going crazy. Burst through the door. Get us out of here. Whew. They have to. They don't have. You know, it could be days, oh, even God. weeks, until they find us. And we have to stay alive till then. The both of us. What about Jacob? If we're going to live, we need to eat. And the only thing oh, left God. to eat is Jacob. Is Jacob. Is Jacob. Oh. Haha, <laughs> you are the weakest link. Now give me those ham bones. Anyways, uh, so this is a control room of sorts. I yeah, this mic is way too close to my mouth right now. I don't know why I moved it up. Um, so this looks like a control room of sorts, which is pretty cool. Let's see what this says. Uh, storage, free, uh, freedom? Question mark. I don't know. Freedom? Question mark. All right. So apparently I'm right there. Uh, kitchen. So we want to go out here. Go straight down. Maybe we'll head to. Maybe we'll head to the kitchen. If we go out here and just down. Down this way, I believe. Whoa. Did I always have that? Did that cut on by itself? Alright, so the red doors mean you can't do shit there, apparently. So, um... Let's go down here. I honestly have no idea what the objective of this is. I guess it's just go where you've not gone yet. What the hell is going on here? Should I have clicked something? Because I feel like I should have clicked... Let's go back and see if we can click on those uh, panels real quick, you guys. I'm sorry. I hate backtracking just as much as the next guy, but I mean, come on, like, we need to do something here. Oh, let's see, it does work. 
But what does that do? Alright, so I'm here, which means down here should be a green light now. The hell is the green? Oh, okay, right here. Right here is now a green light. So let's open this up. Let's see what's in here. Not Jack. Not Jack is in here. Holy poop. I'm getting chills down my spine. I don't even know what this game is about. I think I guess it's about people that just got stranded down here and just died. Like, I mean, there's nothing else to do with it. I mean, so far, this is all I've really came across. Hello? Hello? Anyone in here? Anyone want to party with me? Anybody want to? I'll need something to open the vault. I'll need something to open the vault. Okay, Mr. Smartass, we know. Uh, I guess this will act. Oh! Shit! Stop! Did you find anything, Jacob? There's nothing here. No! I'm starting to think we aren't getting out of this place. <laughs> Did you guys find anything? We found something. We found At least something. until rescue gets here. Oh, really? That's great. What is it? Do, do you have it with you? We have it right here. Isaac, that's just a knife. Close your eyes, Jacob. Oh. And this whole nightmare will soon be over. Oh god, it's brutal. Oh, they killed him! You bastards! How could you kill such an innocent boy? Ooh, I opened this door now. Let's do this shit. Oh, what the hell? For some reason, I just totally got mixed up in where I was going. Alright, let's dip in here. Where we got? So there's a uh, sign that says, run that way as fast as you can. But I'm going to do the exact opposite, because I'm a badass. And these horror games always remember, you are the scary one, you are the badass. Don't let anything ever scare you, because that is not how we do this. Ooh, look, a steering wheel. A loose valve handle. Or a loose Should valve handle. Should be a vault to use it on somewhere. Okay, Mr. Memo Man. I'm just going to take what you say for, uh... Woo, what the hell? This is oh, so fucked up. Shit. How the fuck could we do this? We killed Jacob. Oh, no, you... we ate him. And you ate him. My like isn't going to stop. Unless I stop him. Unless I kill him. So I can live. I have to live. And Isaac has to die. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is just getting, like, worse and worse by the freaking commentary that I find. Whew. Um, so, yeah. So, basically, what's going on here is a bunch of dudes came down here to have a strobe light party in the bathroom. Is what I'm gathering. What I'm gathering from this. They had a strobe light party in the bathroom, which they then took LSD and ate their friends. And lost the key to the door. So it's my job to come down here and go crazy. I woke up because I was too drunk. I woke up in the bathroom stall and had a little bit too much to drink. Oh, you can jump. Holy crap. All right, so this unlocks the uh, the door number TGS05, which should be right down the hallway to the... All right, we'll find it. We'll find it. Don't worry, you guys. I'm a navigator. I'm by birth. I've navigated things in my lifetime. Actually, no, I'm probably the worst person you could get for this job. The worst person. I don't know how long this game actually is, even though I think it is. I believe it did say on IndieDB that it was a, a demo, but I'm not 100% sure, and I don't want to tell you guys false knowledge, so do not take my word for that. So this might be a two-part series. This game overall, though, looks really nice. Look at it. Like, it looks really nice. It's made on the Unreal Engine, so, you know, it's, it's going to be really good. Fairly, really good graphics. Um, the voice acting, I think, is really good. I mean, you guys might have a different opinion, but I think it's pretty good. And I don't want this video to get too long, so I'm probably going to have to cut it into two parts right now. So, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you found this entertaining, and I will leave the link in the description so you guys can go check it out down there. Um, other than that, um, this game is fantastic. Like, so far, I can't find anything wrong with it. I hope you guys enjoyed your very first Terror playthrough on the channel's hub, and I will see all of you in the next video of whatever I make. See you guys!